here is something you don't see every day. A bicycle got swallowed by a tree and is now perched five feet in the air. The bike belongs to 99-year-old Helen Poos, who received it in 1954 as a gift from her community. She gave it to her son, who lost it. It was then rediscovered by the Poos family in a local newspaper. Helen and her son traveled to see the tree and confirmed that it was indeed theirs. It's the weirdest story of this week. I mean, we're talking, <laughs> I'm, I'm doing four to six stories in a, in a given day, and, uh, you know, we're, we, you know, it, it, it's definitely uh, strike the chord with a lot of people. And uh, I think it's just because it's so visual. Now, what's weird about it for me is the fact that it's the tree is only 50 feet away from the highway, and yet nobody necessarily noticed it. And also, the tree was there so long. I mean, the bike was there for so long that a tree could go around it and lift the bike up five feet in the air. I, I find that kind of weird and that nobody might have thought, hey, uh, maybe I better move the bike here. What's also amazing is that the front tire still moves, even though it's been there for uh, 50 years and is stuck in a tree. I, I, I find that kind of interesting. The, remember, the woman who uh, originally won the bike in the first place or received the bike as a gift, she's 99 now. And, it, you know, she's obviously got uh, most of her senses, all of her wits, more than I anyway. And But she, it might be possible that she might, you know, memory serving her she hasn't seen the bike for 50 years there may be no distinguishing marks rusted away so it's possible she might have thought well it it looks enough like the bike i remember that it's the bike i you know i don't think they've done any forensic tests or anything